we've got Moon Taxi in the studio, and they've made it to the terrific two uh, in our Music City Mayhem contest, where we had 32 great local bands in Nashville, and they competed uh, time after time. And you guys actually just got to do a show this past Friday out at Yazoo. How was that? Did you have fun? Oh, it was so much fun, yeah. Yeah, it was uh, amazing. Yeah, we need more free shows like that in Nashville. I can remember <laughs> when I first came to town in 2002, you know, we had Dancing in the District, we had um, Music Midtown, The Thing Outside Bosco's, and uh, it was just such a, the Yazoo show was such a great congregation of musicians and music lovers alike, and what better station than Lightning 100 to bring people together and just appreciate you guys doing that. Yeah, Nyazu Brew, too. I mean, that was an amazing event. I mean, we were just honored to be able to play next to Parachute Musical and Maureen Murphy. I mean, those are some killer acts out mm -hmm. there. Yeah, you know? and Maureen had uh, Gabe Dixon and uh, one of the guys as her backing yeah. band. Yeah, and I mean, she should. I mean, she's got the pipes to back it up, so she's, right. she's incredible. Oh, well, you guys! You guys being kind—that's that's your—that's uh, the artist you're going head to head with uh, today, <laughs> and it's it's the last day you can vote over at Lightning100.com. Uh, we've been uh, playing your song "Common Ground" from your record "Live Ride," and that's the that's your is that your second full length effort? You guys did a studio effort, maybe? Yes. What what uh, what, what is? Uh, tell me about is this melodica. Mm -hmm. When'd you guys put that out? Um, God, I think 2007. We, yeah, we finished yeah. in 2007. Um, Started you know. recording what August of 2006? Is that right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And we and had then, sold out of them, so you can only get it on iTunes right now. Really? Yeah, we might do some more production, but um, as far as I can tell, right now we're just pushing live ride right now. So. Pushing, pushing the live ride. Well, mm -hmm. tell me about this. You guys recorded it here in Nashville at uh, 12th and Porter. Mm -hmm. Who who recorded it? Uh, a company called Mobile Nashville Recording, uh, headed up by the genius Ross Gower, mm -hmm. and he did such a great job. It's it's really electrifying, just the, the presence, the live presence, which is what we wanted to capture mm -hmm. in, in in a live setting. And 12th and Porter is a great venue to do it. I mean, that, that, that place has great sound, great lights. I mean, there's not many venues out there that you can compare. Everyone that was at the show was, was at the show, mm -hmm. and they were, they were present. They were, they were enjoying the music, and they were contributing to it at the same time, which is that's awesome that we have it on something concrete, you know, on, on a record. Yeah, yeah. Well, and it, and it sounds great. I mean, that's the song we've been playing, Common Ground, mm -hmm. and that's got you all the way this far in the contest. Um, yeah, it's definitely it's definitely good. It's live ride, and uh, you can it's you, this is physically it's probably out at Grimey's and yeah, you can get it at Grimey's, and there's a bunch of indie record stores uh, around the southeast and you know actually all over the country mm -hmm. uh, that you can find it at. So d did you guys make any mistakes that night? And and now you listen to the record, you're like, oh man. <laughs> I wouldn't say we made mistakes. It's just, you know, all of our songs are kind of alive in themselves. You know, they, they kind of change a little bit and transform as we get better. And, you know, we keep perfecting things. We never want to leave anything the way it was, you know, a long time ago. So, you know, there, there's songs on there that we don't play the same way. You know, they're just a little different already. Um, so, you know, if you want to see that, you're going to have to come to a show and continually come to shows to see the progression of all these songs. Yeah, speaking of coming to shows, when's the next show? <laughs> Well, we have a tour um, in late April with the New Master Sounds and DJ Logic. Unfortunately, I don't think we're going to be coming to Nashville. We'll be in and around the Southeast, and you can check out the dates on our MySpace. Uh, but next Nashville show is May 7th at the Exit Inn, and uh, we can't wait. It's going to be yeah. fun. Who are you guys playing with? Uh, right now, it's just us, but we're, we're kind of toying with some ideas. I don't want to say anything concrete <laughs> yet, but um, we're trying to get somebody else. So mm -hmm. it'll, be a, it'll be a surprise. When when did you guys form Moon Taxi? How was it? Were you guys all attending Belmont when that happened? Yeah, oh. essentially. Uh, Tom and I have been playing together since we were in high school. We had a high school band. You know, we played really loud, three piece. It was, it was tons of fun. We, you know, what was the name? What was the name of your high school band? Apex. Apex. Yeah. I, I actually used to live near Apex, North Carolina, but anyhow. <laughs> really? Yes. Yes, <laughs> nice. I did. Uh, in Cary. Um, okay, so. You guys, you guys are in Apex, and then then we formed Moon Tax when we came to Nashville. Mm -hmm. Okay, so where was where was the hometown? Was that near Nashville or somewhere? Uh, else? Birmingham, Alabama. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, big shout out to uh, T Webb in Birmingham. Oh, yeah. Who's listening on the <laughs> web? The that's whole right. Birmingham crew. We got yeah. a big Birmingham crew down there. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Yes, mm -hmm. Tyler went to high school with us as well. Um, and you're two years younger, I guess, two two classes younger. But you know, I'd known who he was, but I didn't know him personally. And then he came to Belmont, and we found him as a drummer. We're like, oh my God, this guy's incredible. We got to have him. 
how come I didn't know about this guy when I was in high school? You know, it's well, kind of weird how it I went to go like see the first incarnation of Moon Taxi play a couple times and just thinking, God, these guys are awesome. I want to, I want to play with them, and <laughs> just happened. So. Yeah. Well, it's de- it's definitely a great live record, and I've I've caught you guys down in Murfreesboro and at the Yazoo show, and. If I'm lucky, I'll get out to the exit in on May 7th and get to get to catch you out there. Yeah, it's great. You guys are going to be on tour with DJ Logic and New Master Sounds, mm-hmm. which I was listening on on a MySpace to the New Master Sounds, and that is funky. They're mm-hmm. awesome, man. Yeah, yeah, that's that's really cool. So it's great to uh, to see you guys doing so well. Um, Tommy, which one's Tommy? All right, you're Tommy. Right. So tell me about your day job. You have an interesting day job. Oh man, I, I work for a company called BMI. Um, it's a licensing organization. BMI, I think I might have heard of them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I figured you would have. Um, you know, they're great. I mean, that you know, not only am I working for them, but I'm also a songwriter for them as well. And so I kind of get to do double duty. It feels really good to do that. And uh, we've all just recently become songwriters, and they're going to take care of us. So it's a great company. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. That's great. <laughs> no, that's. I'm glad to hear that. But 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 when you're not having fun writing songs, you're you're calling venues, and be like, so you guys uh, you guys play music in there? Right. Yeah, sort of. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's that's still an interesting concept that mm-hmm. people who are in industry completely get, and maybe people who who aren't don't really know about it. Right, right. Well, you know, I mean, whenever a business is using music, you know, you've got to have the permission to use the songs from the songwriters. Um, BMI does that for you. So, in a nutshell. That's that's the condensed version. I'm not working today, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> well, congrats. It's a beautiful day here in Music mm-hmm. City to have the day off. Mm-hmm. I'm jealous. But no, it doesn't feel like I'm working. I technically am working right now. All right. Well, you can work for Moon Taxi. I'm about to play a song, and we're going to play the full-length version because I love how this record starts off. you got the crowd cheering for you, which has got to be kind our, of... Our fans are fanatic. They are... They... they are who brought us here basically so we we thank them dearly and we couldn't do it without them and you'll hear their presence you know the first couple of seconds of that live record they are there they're with us and we just love them for it they definitely have a lot of fans and i think they're gaining a lot of new fans that's kind of how that works uh you can vote for them if you'd like to at lightning100.com in the music city mayhem contest it is the last day that you can vote for either moon taxi or maureen murphy and we're going to crown the champion tomorrow so uh, we're going to play a track here this is moon taxi from live ride and common ground on lightning 100.9 